Hi, everyone. Hey. Preston and I got home today and uh, had mail from Team Lynch. Yay. So Thank you. <laughs> so I thought I'd turn on the camera and we can open it up and see what goodies might be inside. Uh, thanks, Kathy and Tim. Thank you. What's happening? Huh? <laughs> oh, she's not interested. My goodness. What's wow. Happening here? Oh, wow. All right. Boom. 1918 Great Britain, King George V, three pence. Oh, that is so cool. Look and then that is... You want to just take them out? We can... They're probably right now. Yeah, they're... Right. We have... I'll cut this. Oh, we have some stickers. Yes, we do. Awesome. So there's that. Nice. There's the Rosie from 50, I think. Awesome. And That's very generous. So there's another Rosie. And then this thing... Okay, it is a barber. All right. This is oh, a barber. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, it's just super faint, but yeah. It's yeah, a, yeah. This looks like, like when the beach barbers. Yeah, 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 for sure. Well, very, very awesome. generous of you, Kathy and Tim. Thank you so much. We yeah, appreciate it. fabulous. We'll definitely put the stickers uh, on something we, around the house or on our equipment. And uh, yeah, awesome new silver coins. Thank you. Thank you very much. I like this. Yeah, that's yeah. cool. Here we go. Hello everyone. Hey, Persis and I are at this lake beach. My stuff's already out there and over there waiting for me. Persis jumped out. She's over there in the blue. And he's waving. And yeah, end of summer. The beach is pretty much empty. But the water is still fairly warm, surprisingly. Uh, there are maybe a handful of people in the sand up here and laying out in the sun. It's a beautiful day. And we're hoping to find some things in the water. So this might be our last water hunt for the year. Be our guess, but oh boy, is it beautiful. With the GoPro, things in the distance look really far away, but there's beautiful mountains in the background out there, and just a gorgeous lake. So thank you so much for joining us. I have a iron slash 60s right here. Mostly 60s. Okay, I think I got it. Nope. Nope, 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 no, I did not. It's something deep. All right, finally got it, I think. Oh, it's just a penny, okay. All right, cool. I'll take it, sinking. There's a lot of iron signals out here. But this is definitely a quarter signal. 89.90. And it's a quarter. Oh. <laughs> it's been here for a little while, huh? That's good. Maybe nobody detects out here. We're hoping. It's the first time we're here. Tried to come here once, but uh, bacteria kept us out of the water. I have a 79 right here. I would assume it's a dime. Yep, there it is, a dime. Cool. Awesome. I have a 60, 61, 62 right here. Loud. Assuming it's another penny. Yep, it is. Okay, cool. I have a lovely quarter signal right here. Very loud. There it is, complete with muscle. There we go, nice. We have a faint high tone. This is deep. In both directions, and am near the shore. Pull some out. Oh. All right, well, at least it wasn't that deep.
anything? What is going on? That? It is that. It's a tack. All right, interesting. <laughs> well, happy to get that out of there. Okay. Well, I have this crazy, loud, high 50s, low 60s right here by the shore. All right. Better not be another tack. Not a tack. All right. It's like a old copper ring. Yeah. Definitely was silver plated. Yeah, I would say that's copper. For sure. It's nice though. Hey, it's been there for a while. All right. Another very loud. High 50s into 60. Another ring. What the heck? All right. This one's just uh, an adjustable, like, kid's ring. But still, two rings right up against the shoreline here. Yeah, not seeing anything on it. I mean, it's filthy. But, wow. All right. I have a 61, 62 right here. Let's see what's another penny. So Mike's over there digging rings. I'm over here digging pennies. <laughs> cool. Oh my gosh, there's so much grass here. There it is. Another zincan. Cool. We have a shallow 30 signal. There. Got it. It's an earring. Oh, wow. It's a pretty earring. Bent out of shape. I think it has some writing. Well, that's good. The stones are very shiny, but I doubt that's real gold. Maybe it's silver plated with gold. Good meal? I don't know. I'll check it at home, but I think it's gorgeous. I have a loud 64, 66 right here. Okay, got it. Penny? Oh, no. Oh, look at that. Cool. Yay, I got something. Oh, it's just. Well, no, it's definitely. It says sterling on it. The front of it must have had some gold plating on it. Yeah, 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 this is definitely a really nice, I'm gonna try bending this. Really nice old earring. You go here. I don't really know how that worked, but yeah, that is definitely an earring. Yay, okay, and it says sterling right there, so I got a chunk of silver. Woohoo! all right, cool, I'm on the board. Well, I just had a 1718 right here. Didn't have very high hopes, but this is what just came out in the scoop. And it's just an old copper toe ring, but that's cool. I'll take it. it kind of counts as a ring, right? A little blackened, but uh, yeah, copper toe ring. There we go. 3435. I guess it could be a pull toe. hard to get. <laughs> what is going on here? <sighs> All right. Oh boy. That is not a pull tab. Yeehaw. Uh, Right there, 14 carat, oh my word. 
It does have some writing, that's good. Maybe find the owner. Wow, all right, nice 14 karat wedding band. Good size. Oh, let me go find purses. It actually took me about 10 scoops to get this. Oh, yeah, I just dug a deep cap. Sorry. Okay. Ooh. 14 karat. Oh, that's nice. Look at that. There is some engraving on it. Is there? Cool. Okay. So, we'll check it out. So, yay, gold ring. Yay. <laughs> Hold on tight to that. Yeah. Okay. I have a 33 right here. Pull tab. Okay. Let's try this one. Low 20s. Yeah, I wonder if it's so, like the dirt is so irony. Oh, it's just an aluminum nail. All right. But the dirt is so irony. There is a volcano less than five miles. I mean, it's a dormant volcano, but I wonder if that's why the water is so um, mineral rich. I have a 46, 47, 48 right here. Slash iron, slash 50, slash I don't even know what. <laughs> oh, no, it's just a newer version of some of the old stuff that's in here. All right, that explains it. I have a 23-ish right here. It's kind of irony and weird sounding. But there's something here. It's on the edge of another hole. Yeah. Uh -huh. All right, got it. And it is an earring. Is it really? Yes. I've been kind of ignoring the iron now. Um, so well, this one was a 23 and I'm not straight iron. It just had oh, little okay. hints of, yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. It's silver too. Yeah, it says 925 right there in the middle of the back. Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of a cool looking earring. Yeah, I doubt yeah. anybody hunts out here. Awesome. Way to go. All right, thank you. Hey, little guy. Can I get closer? What the handsome duck you are. Okay, bye. I have a mid-tone right around 25-ish. Doesn't sound very deep. Maybe? Yeah. Whatever it is, it's in the scoop. Okay, it's earring. Green loop earring. I doubt it's precious metal. But it's cool. It's big. It's kind of heavy, I guess. Yeah, probably just plated. Unless those are words. I don't think so. I have a deep 70s right here. I don't know. It's weird sounding. I don't know. It just, it, it sounds like it's edging, but from both directions, so I don't know. All right, I got it, whatever it is. It's gonna take me a while to fill that hole back in. Oh. Oh, really? I'll be darned. It's a barber dime. That is crazy. 1915. Holy cow. Well, I'm glad I caught that little faint signal. My goodness. I think there was a pier here because there's so many big iron spikes and so much iron. And that would, yeah, look at that. <laughs> Mike's gonna be pretty impressed with that one. Woohoo! Oh my goodness! Yay! Super faint. Yeah. Okay, dug a big hole. Are you kidding me? Nope. 1915 Barber Dime. What? <laughs> I think there was an old pier. There's giant iron spikes. There's iron everywhere. There's iron everywhere, but I've been pulling these big spikes out. Oh. What a find. Yeah, yeah. 
<laughs> so that's pretty uh -huh. cool, huh? That's awesome. <laughs> so yay. Well, I just had a 45 right here. I really thought it was gonna be a piece of aluminum garbage. It was in like a hole that already existed, but that is what is in the scoop. Not a piece of garbage. That is a lovely little, that was stupid. Eh, I don't, it's not going anywhere. This is a cute little aluminum ring. That's what that is. It's pretty, but it's aluminum. <laughs> but I'll take it. Cool, it shines. Had a very irony low tone. I just got it out. What is it? There it is. What's this? I mean, this is just crazy. This looks like it's been there forever. I mean, there's iron signals everywhere, and I just dug a, a screw. But, I mean, this isn't precious metal or anything, but it just looks like it's been there for a hundred years. <laughs> My word. All right. Well, very cool. Well, I have some surface, I don't know, double, triple tapping things and stuff happening here. I have no idea what, what it is. Scrape some stuff in the surface here and figure out what I'm seeing, hearing. Yeah, no, nope, didn't get it. All right, it's something right here-ish. I don't know. All right, now it's quiet down there. All right, so it's whatever it is, it's in here. Ooh, look at that. All right, well, that explains all the racket. I think that's very pretty, but I don't think it is anything precious. But it's cool. I will take it. It's blingy and shiny. Eight, nine. Yay, okay. How irony this water is. What's that? Oh, it's a ring, okay. <laughs> a little tiny one. Oh, that's probably why it rang up so low. Huh. Looks like that's been there for a while. I'm guessing maybe silver? It's black. There's a crud on it. Like a little pinwheel type thing. I mean, it's so small. <laughs> uh, definitely have to test it at home. I'm not really seeing anything right off the bat. But, all right. Well, I just had a 13, 16 jumping all around, and this was just attached to my scoop when I pulled it out. So, I don't know. I mean, it looks tarnished enough that it might be a silver earring. So I'm recording it because I think it might be a silver earring. So I'll take it. Whoops, I know that's not what it's supposed to look like. I can kind of reassemble it here. Yeah, there we go. Possible silver hoop earring. It's pretty pliable too. I have a very high 80 to 90 right over that green thing, which I believe is a car. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Porsche 918 Spider from Mattel. All right, well, that's cool. We'll put it with the toy collection. Well, I have a 40 right here. Can't see anything, so I have no idea what it is. But... Oh, got it already. What are you? Ooh, nice ring that was right on the surface. Look at that. So, yeah, I don't know about this one, but it's cool. It's, uh, oh, it's cold out here. Okay. Oh, it's a sun and a moon. It's a shining sun, a smiling sun and a moon. Cool. I don't know. This could go either way. Could, uh, it looks like it's copper. Yeah, definitely looks like it's copper, but I'll take it. It's another ring. Cool. They were pretty solid 23. All right. Oh, that's pretty. I got a rainbow. A little hot earring. Okay. That's very blingy. Very nice. Yeah, I like it. Nice little colored stones. 
All right, cool airing. Welcome to the wrap up of what will probably be our last lake beach hunt for 2024. It's been a great summer being in the water and it was good to end our water hunts with some very nice finds. Here is a bunch of iron, a little bit of lead, a bunch of aluminum, and a couple of copper and brass pieces. Got this little toy Porsche, a whole bunch of clad, including five dollars and quarters, nine dimes, five nickels, three copper pennies, and a bunch of zinc pennies. We got some broken jewelry pieces here, various earrings, and a pewter cross, and six non-precious metal rings, including a toe ring, uh, most of these are brass, even that one which looks aluminum, but that's silver plated. Thought for sure this little one was going to be silver, but I believe it's pewter also. And for our precious metal finds, got three small earrings. I was happy to see that that little heart, one with the rainbow colored stones, was Mach 925 and all this stuff gets acid tested and it did pass. Nice gold plated earring there and that one <laughs> and I think that's one of our first hoop earrings that we found that was actually silver. This used to be a gold plated silver earring. I believe that's very old. It is Mark Sterling. And Persis found a 1915 San Francisco uh, barber dime which is like a yeah, semi key date under a million minted. And the best find of the hunt was this 14 karat gold wedding band uh, with a date of 1945. Kind of explains why it was so deep. It does have the bride and groom's initials on it. But honestly, I can't imagine that they're still alive. But maybe if a family member uh, sees this and, and can tell us uh, what the initials are, we'll certainly give it to them. Well, we hope you've enjoyed our time in the water. Now it's back to getting our hands dirty in the ground and hopefully uh, turn up some more wonderful things. Thank you so much for watching. We hope everybody's doing well and stay tuned for more.